Welcome to the special winter edition season where I post videos every day until Christmas. Make sure to hit the subscribe button so you don't miss any videos. So buckle up and enjoy. In today's video, I wanted to do something a little bit fun, which means I want to get some of the advancements that I've never got before. So if you want to see what advancements I get, make sure to stick to the end of the video. But before we get started with getting some advancements, I want to build a new house over here because I find it a bit empty over here. But which means we're going to have to chop down some trees because I have got hardly any wood left. Oh my god, I'm so fast. Now that I have plenty of wood, I want to actually get some bricks as well. My mouse is starting to really die right now. Hey, what's up, Gary? I do have a few blocks here and there, but not much. All right, so let's get started. We're going to build over here somewhere. Where should we build? You know what? We're going to build like right up here. So we're going to have to do a little tiny bit of terraform, but luckily not too much. All right, so this is the size we're going to go for. So we're going to have to build up these pillars because I kind of want it to be a little bit elevated, the house. And actually, before we get started with building up the pillars, if I can craft this, Jesus Christ. There we go. <laughs> Finally, we're going to place a foundation here like that. And it is going to have a little porch out the front here. Maybe we go out four blocks. That should do the trick. Now, I just realized something. This isn't looking very Christmassy right now. Yes, that is more like it. All right, now we're going to build up the pillars. Just going to do a random height. There we go. And hopefully that is a decent height. And like the other build, we're going to need a lot of logs. Because if you remember, we built the whole roof here out of logs. And I want to do the same thing on this one. I forget how expensive it is to build a roof like this. Oh, no. Who doesn't love the invisible blocks? Because I sure as hell don't myself. What? <clears throat> I was not staring, I swear. I was not staring. Damn, look at this build. It looks amazing. There we go. That's looking good. I might actually extend it one more to see what it looks like. Dang it, I ran out of logs already. Ah. <sighs> But I am liking the build so far. The framework seems pretty good. There is a block right there that shouldn't be there. That one right there. But I am going to have to get a bunch more wood again because it costs a lot. The house is looking uh, a bit plain right now. Hopefully it'll turn out nice in a few minutes. I'm hoping, please. I'm gonna add two pillars on here. There we go. Then we're gonna grab some spruce fence. Go up two. Or is that gonna be too high? Then we're gonna add some trap doors here. There we go. Make it a little bit more 3D looking. Perfect. Actually, what I might do is replace this with some upside down stairs. Damn, which means I've got to replace this with some grass blocks as well. All right, that's not too bad. That is not too bad at all. I might even put a porch here because I can't be asked to go craft more fences. Oh yeah, I forgot about this little thing over here. This was going to be an area where we stored logs. Um, guess I'll do the roof like this. That is one ugly tree. It's like, what, what is that? <laughs> what excuse have you got to have that as your, your leaves? Come on, man. Embarrassing. All right, I guess that'll do. I guess that'll do the trick. So if you guys didn't notice, I do have like a nice little chimney in there with a, a Christmas tree. It does need some lighting. But apart from that, I think this build is actually quite good. It's quick and easy. And that means it gives us enough time to be able to get loads of achievements. Because I slowly want to keep adding houses now around here just to fill it out a bit to make it look a lot nicer. But we do have quite a few builds here now, if you think of it. We've got that one there, the first one um i can't remember what the second thing was oh yeah second thing was the big christmas tree and then the third one if not mistaken was a star we just have loads of builds around here now which is really really cool but i need to clear up this mess right here so let me do that two seconds so we need to check what advancements we have okay so the minecraft ones here are all done now in here what do we need to do so we can start with the top here be our guest use a campfire to collect honey from a beehive using a bottle without aggravating bees all right apply honeycomb to a copper block i could do that because we do have a build with loads of copper blocks which is really good breed all the animals that's gonna be really hard to do that one so not any easier ones all cat variants like a text of a sign. All right, we're going to do this one. Kill a sniper with 50... Well, feet... <laughs> Kill a skeleton from at least 50 meters away. But that means we have to run back to our main base because I think that's where my bow is. And also hit a bullseye from 30 meters away. We should try that as well. And you know what? We are going to get a trident. I do not care. This episode, I'm going to try and get a, a trident. All right, so I managed to make it back here. I got my bow. Our target is 30 meters away. So let's see if we can hit it. I didn't even let go of my mouse there. My mouse is kind of broken right now. Let's see if we can hit it. Wait a minute. That seems like I hit it. Wait, I did. So, do I have to move this back one block, maybe? All right, let's try from here, I guess.
I think I know an easier way to do this. I don't want to use the method with the um, trap doors, but I think if we just got 30 blocks, it should work. So one, two, three, nine, 30. Damn, that was a perfect amount. I don't think this works, this idea. <laughs> this is a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. Well, I'm literally all around it, but not in, in the bullseye. <laughs> all right, so we're going to actually fly around like it's nighttime. We're going to pause on that one for a second, and I need to try to kill a skeleton that is 50 blocks away. Okay, this is a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. Oh. Oh, what a shot. Yes. As early as head sticking by. Yes, I got it. I'm going to collect your XP. Oh, I regret that. Come on, now that i just done the skeleton one, give me this one. Come on. Okay, this is actually really hard. <laughs> I am really starting to get tempted to do the, the trick with the, the hatch. Look how close I am. Oh, come on, we got this. Now, this is ridiculous now. Unless I'm just not far away. Oh, no. Bro, let's hit the bullseye. Just to be sure, I'm going to go one extra block away. Bro, that's over 30 blocks. Bro, that one is in the, in the bullseye. It's kind of in the bullseye. Why is it not counting? Have I already done it? No, I haven't done it. <laughs> what stupid question that is. 30... Oh, this is making me mad. Thank you. Finally. Oh, my fingers are cramping and everything. Oh, we made it. Finally. That's two achievements down. <laughs> like a billion more to go, but let's go. Maybe we could do something very simple because I know I haven't done this yet. It's just gone fishing. Yeet. Oh, here's an achievement. It's coming. There we go. Nice one. And do I have a water bucket? I do have a bucket. Come here. Give me an achievement, Mr. Fish. Don't run away from me. There we go. Tactical fishing. Easy peasy. Do you know what? You can go back. There you go. So what is there? Kill two phantoms with a piercing arrow. That is like probably really hard to do. All right, there we go. Making a crossbow. I don't think I've ever crafted a crossbow. Like really, never. I do have 32 levels. So let's head up here and enchant the crossbow. Hopefully we'll get piercing. I think I do have a piercing book somewhere actually. There we go. Perfect. A quick charge. There's no power on that though which is not very good how do you reload it oh there you go <laughs> that's an easy achievement right there discover every biome i don't know what biomes we're missing but obviously we're missing 12 uh all right so i'm gonna fly about try to fight a pillager outpost because i kind of want to do a raid because i'm guessing that should give us an achievement and i know there is a pillager outpost somewhere near here but i forgot where aha i have found it and it even came with a bit of lag there we go Easy peasy, where's the banner guy? Oh, chill out, guys. Oh, I'm lagging so much. Oh, yeah, loads of XP. Wow, amazing. Man, imagine getting killed by a shovel. All right, looks like I'm gonna have to give up on this one. He's not spawning the banner guy. Oh, that's annoying. Oh, well, it looks like it's getting nighttime anyway, so we do need to head back. Is that a desert or a beach? I need to go check that out quickly. I think it's just a beach. Yep, ah, oh, that's annoying. I was hoping there'd be a desert right next to our base. That'd be really cool. Home sweet home. Hey, what's up, buddy? I don't actually have any food for you, which is annoying. Here you go, my friend. There you go, what a good boy. As I mentioned before, I've never got a trident in normal Minecraft. So hopefully in this ocean, which is over here, I'm hoping, yes, it is, we will find a guy with a trident so that he can give it to me so i heard if you ask him nicely they do actually give it to you actually do you know what i am going to use my full bright resource pack because that means i'll be able to see through the water oh my goodness there's a mushroom biome right next to our base that is actually really cool these are rare these are really rare look at that do you know what? I did also collect a treasure map a long time ago, and we never actually used it. But I just found another one, so I guess if I could get out of the water... Oh, wow, I'm so fast. If I could get out of the water, then we can actually try to look at this map. There we go. So I need to go north or west. So this way should be the right direction. This looks actually really cool, like the cliffside by the water. It's probably on this beach over here. Yes, it is. What a guess. So I am right on top of it, and there was this trick, but I cannot really remember how to do it. Ha, I did figure it out. All right, so now it should be directly underneath me. There we go. Look at that. Water breathing potions. That's perfect. We need those right now. Oh, well, we made it back to the creeper farm. All right, there's a sunken city over here. So hopefully it will spawn a guy with a trident. Oh, oh wow. Look at this. Look how cool this is. It's like a, a snowy hill biome. Oh, but it's the one right next to our base with the Christmas calendar. Oh, this is actually really, really cool. And there's a sunken city over here. Oh, my goodness. There's a lot of people. Oh. Do you know what? Before we end the episode, we are going to do a one simple one. Uh, I know that I, I am capable of doing it because I do it all the time. So we're going to need to go to the nether and then we can actually just hit a fireball from a ghast straight back at it and it gives you an achievement. Because I didn't realise how hard it is to actually get achievements. Oh, I thought that was going to be first try. That would have been so cool. Oh, this is awkward. Come down. Oh, come on. 
Come on, come on, come on. Oh. Yes. There we go. Finally. You guys know what time it is. It is time to open another day of the Christmas calendar. If I'm not mistaken, in the last episode, we did get some Robux, but I can't remember. I can never remember. But anyway, where is day number 12? It is not here. I thought that was 12 for a second. It is... Oh, great. It's right at the top. Yeah, I know. It's, it's a hard jump, innit? I have to fly all the way up there. All right, let's give it a try. All right, all right. Look at this. Nice smooth landing. Okay, maybe not. All right, let's break away all of this and see what we got. All right, so there is a chest inside, and inside the chest there is... Oh, wow. Achievement unlocked. Best viewers ever for reaching the 12th day. Well, guys, thank you so much for reaching the 12th day. And I guess that um, gift right there comes really well with the episode that we just done. But anyway, I hope you guys did enjoy. And as always, if you did, don't forget to leave a comment, like, and subscribe. And guess what? I'll see you in the next video. Peace.